Hi, welcome back to my channel, Skills Go, and welcome to Dagger tutorial in Kotlin language. So till now we have seen a constructor dependency injection and a field dependency injection using Dagger. And now we will see. So we have taken a car example, car, and it is dependent on engine and wheels. So every class has an inject constructor. That's why Dagger knows how to create it. And in this tutorial, we will see what if engine is not a class it is an interface and that time it doesn't have any constructor it should have a implemented classes so if engine interface has a two implemented classes and dagger will create dagger will choose to create one of the engine classes and let's make this engine as interface and see the demo So interface engine and it doesn't have any constructor let's declare a method so whichever the classes implementing this engine they should implement this start method and let's create implemented classes of engine let's create a petrol engine it's a class which is implementing engine and this should implement the unimplemented methods and here let's print line petrol engine started and let's create one more implemented classes just copy and paste it petrol engine let's rename it uh, rename it as diesel engine and let's change this to diesel engine so in order to create instances of diesel engine and petrol engine they should have a constructor with inject annotation let's put a same empty constructor in diesel engine also so diesel engine we have kept we'll keep in petrol engine So in main activity, we have told Dagger to create a car instance. So Dagger will go to car constructor and it will try to construct wheels. So wheels has constructor with inject annotation. So it will create and it will try to create an engine, but it has two implemented classes as this is an interface. Let's execute on this project and see what will be the output and what Dagger will give in exceptions because in this case dagger we should choose between petrol engine and diesel engine so engine cannot be provided without that provides annotated method so as this is an interface dagger is not able to create a engine object in this case we need to use module let's create petrol engine module and let's mark this as and we need to mark this as module and here we will write a method which will return a engine provides petrol engine and let's have petrol engine so we need to keep the written type here and let's take argument as petrol engine and let's return petrol engine and we need to mark this as provides so now we need to tell to dagger to use this module to create a engine object 
so where to tell how to tell let's go to car component in this car component we have to mention a module name here modules equal to petrol engine module dot class so as this is the array we need to keep parentheses so in this case dagger will try to create a car instance it will create a wheels and it whenever it is trying to create an engine it will use this module where we have mentioned the module name it will go to this module and it will see there is a function which is returning an engine instance and it has a argument and it will try to create a petrol engine as petrol engine constructor has a annotation with inject then dagger knows how to create this instance and we will return that instance let's execute this and see whether the object is created or not so the build is successful and in main activity let's remove this we are not showing this in start method we will call engine dot start so this method should print petrol engine started let's execute and see the output So as you can see, petrol engine started and driving. So because of this module, the petrol engine instance is created. If you want to create a diesel engine instance, we need to create a same mo module class for diesel engine and we need to mention that module here. Suppose if we keep both modules here, what will happen? Let's see it. Let's create a same module for diesel engine let's copy this and paste and change to diesel and let's change to diesel and let's create it and diesel engine module provides diesel engine it is just a name convention function can have any name and here diesel engine and we will return diesel engine here and we will mention this module also in car component so now what will happen so now whenever dagger tries to create an engine object it will go to the modules so we have a both modules here also we are getting engine instance in this also we are returning an engine instance so now dagger will get confused let's execute and see the exact exception what dagger gives as you can see we have got error saying engine is bound multiple times so engine is bound in both modules so dagger will get confused so we should not provide two modules in car component we need to provide either petrol engine module or diesel engine module let's remove this So this is how we will create uh, implemented classes and we will provide them to Dagger, which implementation class to create. So in the next tutorial, we will learn how to create a third party class with using Dagger. Suppose if it is a third party class, we can't have an inject constructor. We can't modify that class. That one we will see in next video. I hope you like this video, please share and subscribe, thank you for watching.